welcome to another vlog. If you're new here, I'm a second year PhD student studying math in Canada, and I make mostly study vlogs, but also like a few other videos on some topics that are interesting. So this week's theme is virtual conferences. Right now it's Saturday, which is the first day of this conference for women in math, which is like a really cool thing. But I've never been to a virtual conference before and didn't really know what to expect. So today I thought it would be like some icebreaker thing in a lecture, but really it was the icebreaker thing, which was in Gather Town, and it's like a cool concept. So it's like a little video game thing, but it was kind of hard to navigate for the first time. And then we didn't have a lecture. We had like um, like problem sessions where we were put in breakout rooms in Zoom. And I guess for everyone involved, it's really awkward to just like be put in rooms with strangers and then we kind of had to solve problems and I guess no one knows what each other's background is and everyone is shy like me including me <laughs> no one wants to talk at least everyone had their cameras on um but it, yeah I just spent like one hour awkwardly problem solving with like a few strangers and my armpits got so sweaty <laughs> from the nerves but that aside, it was cool to meet other graduate students, especially other like women, because basically everyone I hang out with here except for two people are men and the two girls aren't in algebra. So now I'm going to put on some more deodorant and go fix myself a cup of coffee because we have something else at four and I, I don't really understand what it is. It's not clear from the schedule, but I think I'll probably need the next like 20 minutes to just drink coffee and decompress a little bit. So I'll see you later. I don't know if the phone will pick this up, but someone's just rapping outside of my apartment. <laughs> it's like so random. So this is my setup for today. I decided to be in my room instead of in the common space just because I have to listen and for some reason my headphones don't work with Zoom. Hey guys! I finished all the conference stuff for today, went on a walk, got some veggie burgers from Harvey's, which I'm excited to eat. And now I'm just gonna call it a night, play games, watch TV, maybe a movie, read probably. And I also got these from my dad, these like little puzzles, so I want to try to do some of those. Good morning, happy May 2-4, happy Monday. It's the first long day of the conference, so I'm just going on an early morning walk. It's super nice out here, not hot anymore, and I think this is a good idea to do before I have to sit in front of the screen for seven hours. So I was just talking to my mom on the phone and I wanted to tell you something that I think is funny. My mom, um, I told her about their conference and as you can probably tell from the vlogs, like I like to wear a sweatshirt every day, even if it's hot, like I'll, I'll wait till I'm like really suffering to switch to a t-shirt and, and I was just like, bro, these are all mathematicians, like some of them do dress really nice and like office casual and stuff, but some are like in their sports clothes, so I think it's funny this discrepancy of mathematicians and possibly academics in general and people in the rest of the world who try to look nice every day and actually think about that stuff. first day is over. There's technically one more hour left of presentations, but I think I'll skip those for today. They're not mandatory and I'm a little bit tired from all the Zoom. But today we had 
the first two like official lectures and then the problem solving sessions which were really fun and this time there wasn't really awkward sounds people actually worked on them which was great we got to do a lot of like diagrammatic stuff which i really like and don't really get to do much at my school so i'll show you so i'm like multiplying these diagrams which are really cute to me they basically represent elements of s2 like that's their identity that swaps one and two um, but it's really fun to me to like play with diagrams like that super fun i loved it and part of the reason i'm skipping the next lectures is i want to continue working on these problems and it's good to feel excited about this stuff so i'll continue working on that and check in with you guys later <music> Happy Tuesday. It's the second full day of the conference and today the first thing on the agenda is some postdoc presentations on their research and one person is doing something on Kajdan Lustig polynomials which I'm pretty sure is something that will come up in my research so I'm excited to get to know a little bit more about what that is. And then after that it's just the lectures again and then some special presentations so there are some to choose from and I think the one I will choose is a discussion on computations and programming and math research and broader career options because I need to know like what, I, <laughs> what my options are after I finish this degree. And then after that it's problem sessions which were really fun so I'm excited for that. I just have 20 minutes until it starts so I'm feeling quite sleepy and I'm gonna like drink my coffee and just chill until then. Hi, it's a quick check-in. We just finished all the lectures for today and now I'm going to that lunch meeting. I just quickly grabbed some bread and Nutella and that's gonna be my lunch because I have like no time to make anything. Like I wish there was like a small break in between Zoom stuff because I feel kind of dead right now even though the presentations were really cool and got to see some more interesting stuff and more diagrammatical stuff. Yeah, it was like three hours of non-stop screen time, which is a lot. Or no, three and a half. It's 1.30, so it was since 10. It's a long time. Hi, so second day of the conference is officially over. I still want to work on the problem sets more by myself, but sometimes I get like kind of stressed out trying to work on them with other people through Zoom because just the lack of a chalkboard makes a huge difference and it's kind of awkward to communicate. Especially like these ideas, it makes it easier if you can write them down and if you're just trying to say it out loud, it's kind of weird and it's kind of hard to gauge like where people are at in the problem. <laughs> it was supposed to end in like five minutes anyway. I only left 15 minutes early, but I'm gonna work on it a little bit more and then make dinner as I'm feeling <laughs> quite depleted. Nice way to end the day is like eat, eating dinner in bed and watching TV. I made this delicious rice salad thing with avocado. And I'm gonna go watch either Inuyasha or The Office. Don't know which one yet. <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow. These guys are so happy. Hello. So I'm actually really intrigued by these problem sets and after watching The Office for like two hours <laughs> I really felt the need to go back to them because sometimes when I'm trying to do these things on Zoom my brains kind of freak me out about having to like interact with people over Zoom who I don't know and I can't like focus on the actual problems so now I can actually do them and they're really fun and I'm actually like getting through them rather quickly so it's really cool and maybe some of these can eventually like could come up in my research or I could look at open problems to do with things like that so I'm learning I like diagrams. <laughs> Maybe that means I'll, I'll, I like category theory. And it is important. One of my profs said, you gotta eat your category theory for breakfast. I think that's some good advice. Good morning and happy Thursday. So today is the second last day of the conference and we have a meeting starting at 10. Sorry, I just saw someone walk by and I got embarrassed. <laughs> um, 
uh, we have like a social event at 10 which is pretty exciting and I'm going to go to treat myself to some Starbucks first uh, before the event starts and looking forward to that I'll take you guys along today and we'll see what the rest of the day is like so both lectures just finished and I'm feeling so tired like I don't know where people get their energy from we're just learning all the time like I really want to but I feel like I'm about to pass out. Anyway, the coffee thing was good. I'm kind of shy and awkward, so usually just like I'm there being <laughs> awkward and not saying anything, and, and then eventually like something will happen. Usually that's like wh how I make friends, I guess. And today, like I managed to meet a girl who's like geographically close to me, and she also knew someone who used to work at my university. So that was cool, and we like added each other <laughs> on Discord and stuff. That was quite exciting for me. And there's like 10 minutes now for me to make a coffee and try to like stop being a zombie. And then I'm gonna go to this like casual lunch thing that's about publishing papers, because that's like one of my dreams, which I should do it before I'm done. But you know, there's also the doubt that like, what if I never publish anything? I don't know. So uh, hopefully I can learn about the process of publishing, uh, people's experiences and stuff from my seniors. So that'll be interesting. And then I hope I'm alive enough for the problem sessions to work on them and be useful because they're pretty fun. Uh, so I'll check in with you guys after that. So I think the Zoom fatigue really took over and I'm just gonna be a potato for the rest of the day. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Good morning, happy Friday. So it's the last day of the summer school and it's bittersweet because I've really enjoyed it so I'm sad that this is ending but also tomorrow I get to sleep in for a long time and I'm quite tired so. There was another coffee social this morning and I meant to go to it but I was too slow in the morning getting ready so. I'll just like log in for the last 15 minutes and see what's going on. And then we just have our final postdoc seminars and last two lectures and then the like ending ending event thing in Gather Town. So today it's really cold in Ontario, it's like seven degrees and I like that. So I'm like, I feel really cozy in my sweatshirt and my like knit leggings. <laughs> It makes me happy. And so I'm just gonna fix myself a cup of coffee and see what they're talking about in the coffee break. wanted to check in because I realized this is probably gonna be the end of the vlog and I haven't checked in since this morning so today was the last day of the conference and the final two lectures were really good and I'm definitely this weekend gonna go back over and like review what I learned and try some more exercises that I didn't get to finish this week hopefully like that'll help it sink in a little bit and if you ever have an opportunity to do something like that, you definitely should take it. It was great, got to meet a lot of people. Um, I even met one of my subscribers there, so hello Amanda. It was really cool and I hope I get to do something like this again in the future, especially when things are in real life again and not Zoom. So Celeste and I are just gonna play Animal Crossing, even though she never comes to my island anymore. Does she come to your island? It seems like this girl's been slacking. <laughs> anyway, have a good week everyone. I'll see you in the next vlog. Take care. Bye bye.